Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel or if you guys are new here for the first time, then hello, welcome. In today's video, we have a very exciting video because it is the first Christmas video of 2021. I am so excited to finally be bringing you Christmas content. I told you in one of my last videos that Christmas content was coming very, very soon, and I am bringing it to you guys today. We have a Christmas haul where I will be sharing with you the things that I've picked up for the Christmas season. Now, everything that I share with you in today's video is either from Walmart or Target, and all of these items are pretty affordable. I will have everything that I can linked in the description box down below as always if you are not already please make sure to follow me over on Instagram the link is always in the description box down below I share so much more with you guys over there than I do here on YouTube so make sure to follow me if you're not already and before we get on to the video I wanted to also let you know I have a new intro for my videos for the holiday season my sweet friend Cass made me a new intro she made my last intro that you guys see in a lot of my videos so if you have not already please make sure to go check her out show her some love she creates the most amazing content I will have her links to her socials in the description box down below as well and without further ado let's go ahead and get on to our first Christmas video of this season and let's Let's roll my new intro for the holidays. I hope that you guys enjoyed that winter slash Christmas intro. I absolutely love it. Make sure to check the description box, like I said, for her Instagram and YouTube channel. So before we get into the Christmas haul, I do want to give a shout out again to my favorite water bottle in the whole entire world. I bring this thing everywhere with me. It's from the coldest water. They have so many different options on their website. I will have a link in the description box down below for you guys. Mine is actually engraved with my YouTube and Instagram name, which is just like my favorite thing in the whole entire world. So again, if you guys are interested in checking them out, the link will be in the description box down below. All right, so now we're going to get into all of the goodies that I got for this holiday season. So we're going to start with the things that I got from Walmart. Walmart has seriously stepped up their game, you guys. It absolutely blows my mind how many cute things they have now, not only in like the home decor section, but also clothing and all of that stuff. So my friend Megan that I've met through social media, she always shows me the cutest things. Like she'll send me pictures and I'm like, I 100% need that, so. Thank you, but not thank you, because I probably didn't need half the things <laughs> that I've gotten because of her. But these pillows are $5 at Walmart. They have them in like a giant bin. I think they probably have close to like 10 different styles. These are their outdoor pillows. For $5, you cannot go wrong. This one is hands down my favorite. It says Farm Fresh Christmas Trees apple cider and hot cocoa. We're going to put these on our front porch on our rocking chairs. So I did get two of them. The other one is across the counter, so I'm not gonna grab it. But two identical pillows to this. They are obviously like weather resistant, which is fantastic. I did also get another one for my egg chair, which is out on my patio. They are starting our landscape this week, fingers crossed. But anyways, this is the one that we got for the egg chair. It just says Merry Christmas with the infamous red truck with some trees in the back of it. Love the way that this one looks. And then on the back, it has a bunch of small little red trucks. I think I like this side more than I do this side, but we shall see. The nice thing is that you can flip it back and forth. I am going to try and cut off all of the tags to my pillows because I'm really bad about that as well. And a lot of you guys have noticed it in my videos, like when I do decorate with me's in my living room, I have a million tags on my pillows. So hold me accountable, you guys, and tell me to cut off the tags on my pillows because they drive me insane, but I'm just 
too lazy to do it apparently. So the next two things that I got are these adorable little reindeers. The first one is the bigger version. It is black with white polka dots, this adorable little scarf. And my favorite part is it has a little pine cone for a tail the cutest. I'm going to give you guys a closer up view. So the bigger ones were $6.48. They did have another style. I think they come in like a red color as well. I love their little legs and how tall and skinny they are. And then I got the smaller version that has like black and white stripes. Again, another scarf and a cute little pine cone tail as well. So they are not like super different in size, but you can definitely stagger them. I, again, have zero idea what I'm gonna do with any of these things that I got. The smaller one was $4.98, so a $2 difference. These are really affordable in my opinion. You can also get two more little deer decor pieces. These were $8.98. And I love the material that they have on here. It's kind of like a sweater material. They have this really pretty wreath around the neck area. So there's a close up of those little guys. They did also have one that was like laying down, which I had debated getting as well. But when I put them next to each other, it just didn't look right. So I thought I would just get two of them standing up. One thing I will tell you guys, which I'm sure you all are aware of, with all of the shortages of everything and the cargo ships like just being parked pretty much, not being able to unload anything, if you guys see anything that you want for the Christmas season, whether you're shopping for family and friends or you want it just for decor, get it while you see it. I cannot tell you how many times I have seen something that I really like and I don't pick it up and then I never find it again. It's sold out forever. So if you see something you like, pick it up. You can always return it if you don't end up using it. Just get it while you can. The next thing that I got is this nine foot garland. This was $5.98. I'm sure you guys have seen that Walmart also has a ton of beaded garland. Now, I think this is mainly for putting it around the Christmas tree, which I have actually never done, but I got this just to use as decor. It does have like the tassels at the end, which I really love. These are really hard to find now as well. Such an affordable price, you guys. Absolutely crazy. $5.98 for a nine foot beaded garland is craziness. You can use these year round as well. You don't obviously just have to use these for Christmas. So if your store has them and you've been looking for affordable beaded garland, definitely check out Walmart. So the next two things are actually the last items that I got from Walmart. I absolutely adore these. They were a little on the expensive side. The price tag actually fell off the bottom, but I believe these were like $19.98. So the bottom of these Christmas trees have the most beautiful faux leather. The Christmas tree itself has a lot of glitter on them, so they are a little messy. It does have a cute little Merry Christmas tag at the top, but when I saw these, I just absolutely fell in love with them. I did get two of them. I usually always do that when I get decor pieces because I feel like if you just get one, you're always gonna need two, so did pick up two of them. They have quite a few different little like potted Christmas trees this year. I want to say there's probably three or four different ones. So I will try to link as much as I can, like I said, in the description box down below. I don't know how much of this stuff is going to be sold out, but if it is sold out online or I can't find it, make sure to check out your local Walmart. I'm sure that wherever you guys live, there's multiple Walmarts. So take a little adventure one day. <laughs> if you can't find something at one Walmart, go to another. That is what I do because I am crazy. <laughs> But we are going to move on to Target now. All of this stuff is from the Bullseye Playground area or the Dollar Spot, whatever you wanna call it. So unfortunately, I cannot link any of this stuff. They do have some items online, but usually most of the stuff is only available in store. So the first two things that I got are these greenery picks. These were $3 each. I just thought these were absolutely beautiful. So this is what they look like. They are very glittery and I thought these would be really great for like a centerpiece on the kitchen island or even on the kitchen table to put into a vase or something. Or I could even use them over on my table across from my kitchen area 
to kind of accent the side of the mirror or something. I will figure out something to do with these. I just thought they were so beautiful, so I didn't want to pass those up. I did also get these really cute wooden homes. These were $5 each. So this is what they look like. They have a really pretty wreath right there on the front. They are a dark brown wood with a white roof. They do have three different styles. I personally only liked this one. They have one that's like a triangle, which I really don't like, so I didn't pick that one up. And they also have another white house, but these are my favorite, so I decided to pick them up while I saw them because again, especially the Target Dollar Spot or Bullseye Playground area, that stuff goes so quick. It's absolutely insane. The next two items were $3 each. They are these glass trees. These are dark green. I really love the look of these and I really love the look of these. They did have a bunch of other options and colors of these glass trees, but these are the ones that I liked. They were the most like neutral toned ones, I guess. And then they also had the little smaller version of them as well. These were a dollar each. And then I did also pick up some of these like little presents and candy canes. These were $1 each as well. I want to try to make my own gnomes. Now, if you guys have followed me for a while, you know that I absolutely adore gnomes. I'm kind of phasing out of them just because I feel like it was a, a fad and now I'm kind of growing out of it just like my Ray Dunn collection. At least I don't love them for my decor. I have two of them up, which you guys saw in my Halloween decorate with me, but I just don't think I want to get any more, but I do kind of want to try to make my own. So I did get these. These were a dollar each. I thought it would be cute to have like the gnome holding a little present or a little candy cane. I don't know what else you would use these for. If you guys have any suggestions, let me know in the comments down below. And then the last thing that I got was $5. It's one of the trays that they came out with this year. I think they have four different trays. I really like the white milk and cookies as well, but I'm not going to go crazy trying to hunt for these things. Just picked this one up when I saw it. It was literally the only one in the dollar spot section the other day. So it's the Christmas tree, a little crate. Again, no idea what I'm gonna do with it, but I have thought about like putting some of these trees, which the bigger ones actually don't fit but I think like the little ones would look cute if I put them in there and then put some bigger ones in the back. If you guys have any inspiration, let me know in the comments down below. I am a part of like the Target Bullseye Playground area page on Facebook. I will try to link it in the description box down below if I remember. You guys can remind me in the comments if I forget, but that is it for this Christmas haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and make sure you're subscribed to my channel down below. If you have any ideas for content that you would like to see for the holiday season, please make sure to let me know in the comments down below. I would love to make videos and content of what you guys enjoy watching. And again, if you guys do not follow me on Instagram, please make sure to do so. The link is always in the description box down below. Thank you so much for watching as always, and I will see you in my next one. Bye, Stimmerbalus.